guess I'll do some spidey work while I wait for Sable's call. Hey, what's that? What's with all the yellow stuff? Huh. Is this some weird street artist thing? A police report? Looks like someone was killed during a mugging, but nothing was stolen. Hmm. What's with the audio recorder? So, you have some work-related stress. Well, you came to the right place. That's my specialty. So they tell me. Give me some more specifics about how you're feeling. Guess you could say I put a lot of pressure on myself. I like to be the best. Plus, I have a very demanding boss. Then what kind of work do you do? Everything here stays confidential, right? Of course. Good. Because if any of this gets out, you're a dead man. The case file says one of nine. There must be more of these out in the city. There's a bunch of GPS coordinates here. I love treasure hunts, but something tells me I'm not gonna find a chest full of gold at any of these places. She could be running out of minutes on her cell phone platform. I mean, she's probably doing international roaming. That stuff is expensive. Or maybe she just really needed to polish her pistols. Let's apply Occam's razor. The simplest and most obvious solution is... She hates me. Ugh. Logic takes the fun out of everything. about this live-streaming egomaniac screw. It's bad enough her show features and glorifies that narcissistic webhead Spider-Man, but her <laughs> shows, if you can even call them that, are putting hard-working New Yorkers in harm's way just so she can gain followers. Whatever that means. Can't you see her ridiculous stunts are nothing more than a desperate ploy for attention? Come on, folks. You're smarter than that. By watching her shows, you're literally hurting yourselves. So, you ask, what should we do instead, Jonah? Here's an idea. Tune into my show instead. The only thing I'll hurt you with is the... I remember Yuri saying this was ruled an accidental death. Food poisoning, I think. I'm feeling a little uncomfortable. I think we should end the session. Sorry, Doc. I didn't mean to scare you. I've just been paranoid lately. Like I said, stressful job. Okay. <laughs> Tell me a little bit more about your job. Describe a typical day. Hmm. Typical day? I guess it starts with waking up, checking my phone, see what the boss wants me to hit that day. Then I go grab breakfast. I've been trying to do that keto thing, you know? Then I do the hits. Sometimes it's messy, so I gotta head home and clean up. I try to get to the gym in the afternoon, and dinner, and I... Sorry, um, can you go back for a moment? What does do a hit mean exactly? It means I kill who my boss tells me to. I'm pretty good at it by now. Got quite the resume. <laughs> this guy sounds like a Magia enforcer. Feels like this is just part of the story. I should keep an eye out for more scenes like this. Attention units. Pursuit is in progress of two stolen APCs. Incident is active near Grand Central.
Officers are in pursuit of truck with stolen stable equipment. setting up these scenes really likes the color yellow. Another crime report. Another crime... I remember this. A person got electrocuted accidentally but the victim had ties to Hammerhead. Yuri tried, but couldn't find evidence of foul play. Let's hear what the recorder has to say. So what do you think, Doc? Well, clinically, you're a sociopath. You have no remorse for your actions. You clearly are not stressed. I doubt you think there's actually anything wrong with you. So, why did you really come see me today? <laughs> you're smart. I like that. Okay, let's get right to it then. You do what I tell you, and I won't kill your family. Whoa. You want to get right to it? Huh? Okay then. I know why you're really here. I knew who you were the minute you walked in that door. And I also know that before I do anything for you, you're gonna do something for me. Well, that took a turn. These crime scenes all feel like covers for Magia hits. And if the guy on the tape is a Magia enforcer, Maybe he's the one who killed all these people. Better take a closer look. of police tape and equipment at these scenes. Whoever's doing this must have access to this stuff. I remember Yuri telling me about a drowning here. She was suspicious because the victim was a competitive swimmer. On the last recording, the therapist turned the tables on the Magia guy. Subway's that way. Welcome back. Have a seat. So, did you bring the, um... Yeah. Hope this takes care of your cash flow problem. Right. It most certainly does. Thank you. So, I assume you came to me because I have a few police officers as clients. You assume correct. But my boss and I are only interested in one of them. And who might that be? Captain Yuri Watanabe. Yuri? How is she mixed up in this? I'm afraid of where this story is going. I have to keep following it. It's him! Get a Nearby. Another setup for me. All units, a shipment of stable equipment is under attack by Magia. Please. Another file and recorder.
Uh, you okay? file and recorder. I think there was a hit and run here recently. The victim was set to testify against one of Hammerhead's men. But of course, police never found a suspect. In the last recording, they talked about getting Yuri's mental health records. Here's Captain Watanabe's file. Hmm. This everything? Yes. You ever record her sessions? No, I never record any sessions. That'd be unethical and illegal. Well, we'd like you to record her next session. And my boss has a list of questions he'd like you to ask. That gonna be a problem for you? No, no, no problem. I feel like I shouldn't be listening to these. And yet I can't stop. Seems that whoever left these wasn't satisfied with what the police concluded. has a good reason. All units, armed suspects have seized control of the stable equipment. There's a report and recorder. Someone fell to their death from this ledge. It was ruled an accident. But was it? All of these reports are from the last year or so. But last month, Yuri assigned herself to all of these cases. Was Yuri the one who left all those recordings? Okay, Yuri, let's move on. Have your obsessive thoughts about the suspect continued? Yes. Sometimes I feel like I've almost got him. And sometimes I feel like I'll never get him. Are you doing your breathing exercises? Trying to. But... I know who he is. I know where he is. And I know what he's done. But I can't do anything. Not without legally admissible evidence. That must be frustrating. You have no idea. Seems like Yuri's hunch is that the guy on the tape is the guy that killed all these people. I think she might be right. I'm... Watch out! They took more guys were on the way! I think I'm close. And there's the trademark yellow. The recorder must be around here somewhere. Police ruled this a suicide, but Yuri had her doubts. The victim was part of Hammerhead's crime family. On the last one, Yuri sounded frustrated. You have no idea. That's it? Yes. I mean, we talked a little bit about her medication, but... When is the next session? Why? What are you going to do? I'm gonna do whatever my boss does, Megan, though. Oh no! Are they setting up a hit on Yuri? Gotta get to those other locations. Who plague our city? And finally, finally, 
one brave anonymous caller has delivered the goods. We have clear photos of Spider-Man standing in the immediate vicinity of caches of humanitarian aid. Aid that was intended for Simcaria. And our heroic caller assures me that these very humanitarian caches are being sold on the black market. If I've learned one thing in my years as a world-renowned reporter, it's this. Photos don't lie. Spider-Man has been caught red-handed. No pun intended, puns are for whips. So what do we do about it, you ask? We wait. We wait for the police to finally wake up and arrest this mass lunatic. These case files are getting more and more recent. This one happened just a few weeks ago. You seem nervous. Yeah, well... The Chief knew I was working undercover with you. I can't afford to lose my job. Maybe I should be the one doing breathing exercises. Well, isn't that interesting? Don't worry. I won't tell if you don't. Also, you're doing great. You're a very authentic-looking doctor. Thanks. I think. You think he knows you were wearing a wire? If he does, he's a hell of a good liar. He's a Magia enforcer. We know he's a good liar. Question is... Does he know he's being lied to? We'll find out tomorrow, I guess. You sure about all this? We catch him in the act of trying to murder a police officer. He gets put away for life. Yuri, what are you doing? I have to find her. All units, officers are in pursuit. Hey, I think I'm close to the last crime scene location. Yuri's been here. Now where's the file? Hi. This looks familiar. I think it's the last known location of a Magia informant who disappeared a few months ago. all ever be. I'm all wired up on my way to the office. Just picking up a coffee first. Okay. Drinks are on me when this is done. <laughs> Looking forward to it, Captain. Yuri's suspended, but she still won't give up. Hard not to respect that. Hi. Can I just get a large coffee? Hey there, Dot. Who's that you were just talking to? Oh. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I listen to that? Call from an unknown number. Hello? Hello, old friend. Yuri? Meet me at the corner of Madison and 23rd. We need to talk. Wait, wait, Yuri! Ah, she's gone. With all that's happened to Yuri, she must be beyond hurting. She doesn't do anything without a reason. So why did she lead me on a grisly crime scene tour? She must have a lead on this enforcer guy. It'll be nice to see her. Maybe help her deal with whatever she's dealing with. What? Yuri, what did you do? That's the Magia Enforcer. Dead. And the case files from all his victims. This guy killed all these people. But does that mean he deserved to die? Yuri! I know what you're gonna say, but just hear me out. The system works most of the time. 
but there are times when it doesn't. And to me, that's unacceptable. Some people put their trust in fate, or karma, or whatever. But I can only trust me. You can't kill people, Yuri. Apparently I can. And you know what? It felt good. You need to turn yourself in. For what? I just dispensed justice. True justice. And I restored a little bit of balance to the world. You're my friend, Yuri. I don't want to come after you. You do what you have to do, and I'll do what I have to do. Goodbye, Spider-Man. Yuri! Tom, what am I gonna do? This all makes sense now. What Yuri did to Hammerhead. She's been struggling with this for a while. She's always held in her emotions. That must take a toll on her. But she's also the most tenacious and stubborn person I know. This was a bad guy for sure, but killing him? That's too much.